Welcome to your weekly Spreadsheet Life Google Sheets Challenge. This week, I will be giving you four questions from easy to hard to test your sort and filter knowledge in Google Sheets. And as with all of these challenge videos, you can find the link to download this spreadsheet down in the description. Then you can pause the video before I arrive at each question, give it your best shot, and then you can see how I do it. Okie dokie, if that sounds good to you and you think you're up to the challenge, then let's get to it. Okie dokie. Starting with question number one, your task is to filter the data so that only category B products are visible. To tackle this problem, you first need to add a filter by selecting the data and then go to data and then create a filter. From here, just click on the filter button next to category. Click where it says clear, select category B, and then click on OK. You have now filtered your data so that only category B products are now visible. Awesome. Let's move on to question two. This time, your goal is to sort the data by category and then by quantity and then by cost, all in ascending order. To pull this off, start by selecting all of the cells and then go to data, sort range, advanced range sorting options. And in the window that appears, go ahead and check the box next to data has header row. Now the first column that you want to sort by is the category column. So for the sort by option, select category. Next, click on add another sort column and then select quantity. Add one more sort column and for this one, select cost. Now you want to sort everything in ascending order. So leave all three options set as A to Z. And then finally click on sort. You now have all of the data sorted by category and then by quantity and then by cost all in ascending order. Awesome. Let's head on over to question number three. For this one, you have to write a formula to return all products with a cost greater than 25. Also, you want that result sorted by cost in descending order. So to accomplish a task like this, you will need to use the sort and filter functions available in Google Sheets. Start by selecting cell B5. In this cell, enter the formula equals sort function, filter function, and then for the first argument, select the original data range. For the second argument, select the cost values, and you want to filter by the costs that are greater than 25. So enter a greater than symbol and then 25. Now close parentheses and enter a comma to bring you to the second argument for the sort function. You want to sort by the cost values, which are in column five of your data range. So enter a value of five. And for the last argument, you want to sort in descending order. So you need to enter false. Now you can close parentheses and hit enter. You then get back all of the products with a cost greater than 25 and that result is sorted in descending order. Fantastic. Let's move on to the last question. For this question, you must write a formula to return all of the products with an SKU beginning with the letter B. Now there are two functions that you can use to solve this problem, the filter function and the left function. So once again, starting in cell B5, enter the formula equals filter, and then select the original data range. Now you want to filter based on the first letter of each product SKU. So for the second argument of the filter function, you will enter the left function. You are going to use the left function to extract the first letter from each SKU. So for the first argument of the left function, select all of the SKU values. Then for the second argument, enter a one because you only want the first letter. You can now close parentheses and enter equals and then B in double quotes. Finally, close parentheses one more time and hit enter. As a result, you get back only those products with an SKU starting with the letter B. How about that? Well, I hope you had a ton of fun working through this week's Google Sheets challenge and be sure to leave me a comment down below to let me know how you did. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any videos like this one. 
And until next time, I will see you in the next Spreadsheet Life video.